Hello and welcome to Simplified Guitar. In this lesson, we're going to be learning the song Down in the Valley by Johnny Cash. But before we do that, if you would like to learn the 18 chords and three strum patterns that I use in this song and all of my song tutorials, then you can get that by clicking on the information card at the top right corner of this video at any point during the lesson. All right, let's go ahead and get started. All right, this is a great song to learn as a beginner because there are only two chords. We have the C chord and the G. Now keep in mind for the C chord, you want to make sure not to pluck that low E string that is not part of the chord. So you can use your thumb over here to come across the top and just mute that low E string so it doesn't resonate as you strum. Also for the transition from the C to the G, it'll make it a little bit easier for you if you focus on your second and third finger first, getting those up to that G and then getting your pinky down on the bottom because that first beat of the measure, you're not going to be strumming down here on this string anyway. So it gives you an extra beat to get that finger down there. We're going to be using the swing pattern for this song, which is a three beat strum pattern, which gives us three down strums and then an up strum after beat three, which would sound like this. One, two, three, and one, two, three, and one, two, three, and one. Also, to add some dynamics to that pattern, we're only going to be plucking the first note of the first beat of each measure, okay? So again, if I were to uh, play the C with this strum pattern, it would sound like this. One, two, three, and 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 one. Now remember, as I said earlier for that C chord, that low E string is not part of the chord. So when you're going to be plucking the first note of that chord, it's going to be the A string, not that low E string. Okay, so keep that in mind as you play. All right, so now I'm going to go ahead and play the song for you. Feel free to play along with me if you want. I hope you enjoyed this lesson. If you would like to get the chord chart for this song as well as watch the play along demo in slow motion and at full speed for this and many other songs, you can click on the link right here to head on over to the website. All right, I hope to see you in another lesson. Mm -hmm.